How did you experience experience this game, Eva? Oh, this game was amazing. Um, I thought we dominated from the start, and we deserved more goals in the first half. But you know that's football. Sometimes you dominate the game, and sometimes you don't score. But the best team won tonight, and you know credit to the boys. They they kept going, they kept fighting until the end, and you could see that with the winning winning mentality everyone's got in the team. How did you experience the atmosphere in the stadium when they scored this decisive goal in, in the extra time? Oh, it was amazing. Um, I was out there jumping um, with Soren. We were jumping, hugging each other after the goal. And it was just an amazing experience, you know. And to go on the pitch and, and celebrate with the team and the fans was amazing. And welcome to Michelin. A lot of people are looking forward to seeing what kind of player you are. If you should describe yourself as a player, what are the words then? Uh, <laughs> I don't know how to describe it, but I like to to attack and run at defenders. Um, that's my type of game, and I really look forward to to doing what I do. And hopefully, the fans like it, and the coach likes it, and it and it suits the team. So, really looking forward to it. Your history so far, just in a few words, both uh, with football and your private history. Could you try, try and tell us what kind of person you are, what you've been going through? Yeah, um, I was born in the refugee camp in, in, in Kenya, Kakuma, and Sudanese, South Sudanese background, my parents. And I came to Australia in 2006 with their family and started playing football you know, for a club there. And then I got picked up by Ala United and... You know, thank God everything worked out. And off the pitch, um, you know, I'm a guy that likes to give back. So recently we've started a foundation called Barefoot to Boot. And it's where we go back to the refugee camp every year and and deliver football boots to the to the refugees there because football is the main thing there. It's the main sport. And, you know, I thought it was a good idea. We thought it was a good idea to, to go back home and donate some boots and take them to, to Africa, you know, so that's what I, off the pitch, I like to I like to help out the, the less fortunate one. That's a very good course. Uh, the last thing, try and uh, pronounce your name so people know. Yeah, it's normally a word, but it's through soccer, it's been changed to Awa, so now I prefer Awa Mobile, and Awa is how you pronounce it. Thank you very much. Thank you.